What's up my beautiful people? Welcome back to a brand new video. Happy New Year guys! Ooh, first video of the new year. I'm super 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 excited to be back. Um, I took a week off. Uh, maybe two weeks. Actually I don't remember the last time I posted but I took some time off. I wasn't feeling the greatest last week and I didn't want to like be all meh in a video. So I decided to just not film and not post and just take an extra week off. Now we're back and I was scrolling through Pinterest and I found this picture right here and I was like, I need to recreate this. Like I've seen it a couple times on my Pinterest, but now, guys, now I can actually recreate it because my amazing brother and sister-in-law got me this for Christmas. Uh, it's the ColourPop Cream Gel Color Bolt in like a dynamite and I'm, I've been using it. I'm not gonna lie, I, I have been using it and uh, I love it. So I'm really, really excited for this year. Like I'm excited to like kind of step out of my comfort zone when it comes to makeup. Like I typically do very natural looking eyes and like just stick into like browns and like plums and stuff like that. But I really, really, really want to step out of my comfort zone this year. Last year I stepped out a little bit, but this year I really want to. So we have this and I'm really excited to start using this and like integrating it into my makeup. So that's what we're doing today. So this makeup look right here is what we're going to recreate. So uh, let's just get into the video. Okay, so I'm also going to be using these two palettes. Um, this is the Bare Necessities and the Smoke and Roses ColourPop palette. This I got from my sister for Christmas. Um, I got a lot of ColourPop for Christmas, I'm not going to lie, and I'm not upset about it. Like, I'm actually super, super, super stoked because that means that I can create more looks for you guys. So I'm really excited. This palette is absolutely stunning. If you guys didn't see it on ColourPop, go check it out. Um, but look at those freaking colors. I can't wait to create, like, I cannot wait to create looks with this for you guys. We're just going to create, like, a very natural eye, um, because in the picture, it kind of seems like she has, like, a brown, um, in her crease, so I, I guess that's what we'll do. I'm going to put, like, some white into, like, on the actual lid to kind of just create, like, a, a natural eye. But, yeah, so that's what we're doing. I'm also, I'm also gonna be trying out these lashes. This is the Falsy, the, the, the ColourPop Falsy Lashes in Honey. And um, they're really cute. So that's what they look like. <laughs> wow, way to go, Anna. <laughs> so that's what they look like. Um, they look like the O3s that I wear from, I believe it's Kiss Lashes. The band's a bit thick though. We'll see. If not these, then I'm just gonna use the um, Ardell Naked Lashes and 424. Uh, and yes, so uh, let's get in with the makeup look. All right, so for the lid, we're gonna go in with Attraction from the Smoke and Roses ColourPop palette. Uh, we're just gonna put this on the entire lid. Now we're gonna go in with Kickstart from Smoke and Roses palette, ColourPop palette. We're gonna put that into our crease. We're gonna do our black liner. Um, we're just going to do it the way we normally do. We're just gonna wing it. Get it because it's a wing liner.
So this is the part where it's gonna get tricky. We're gonna go in with the ColourPop Stardust Cream Gel Color. We're going to put that over the black liner. So that took a lot more time going on. This side right here was a freaking mission to put on. I feel like this cream pot was like old or something because it's just not um, easy to work with. Like it's so hard. I've used some of the other colors in here and it was like the easiest thing to do. Whereas this is like literally just trying to put on clay on your face. Like it just was not working so this is the best that I, I can get um i smooth out the edges with the black liner um and that's pretty much as good as that's gonna get um i'm actually quite disappointed in that but it's fine we're gonna work with it so now for the inner corners we're gonna go in with a yellow and we're gonna go in with abstract from the color pop into the hue palette It's definitely not the same color as like the cream uh, liner. The cream liner is like a pastel yellow. I don't really have like a pastel yellow. So we're just gonna do this and uh, hope for the best. I'm gonna put a bit of Lucky Charm from the ColourPop into the Hue palette and we're gonna put that into the inner corner as well. All right, so I decided to stick with the lashes that I normally do, which is the Ardell Naked Lashes in 424. I don't like how thick the band is on the ColourPop ones. So we're just gonna stick with the what with what we know and what we love. All these makeup gurus make putting on lashes look so freaking easy, and I'm always freaking struggling, my guys. Okay, to complete the look, we are going to put on Maybelline New York Sky High Mascara on our bottom lashes. And then for our top lashes, we're gonna go in with the Essence Volume Stylist 18 Hour Curl and Hold Mascara. Finished look. This is it. Um, huh. Honestly, we'll zoom out and talk about it. I love the look. It looks great. The only thing that I'm super, super frustrated with is how difficult it was to use that cream gel um, from ColourPop. I used two of the other colors prior to making this look or doing this look and I didn't have that trouble with those other colors. Those colors glided on so smoothly and like so perfectly. But this freaking yellow was like, I have it on my hand. It doesn't want to come off. Like it's right there. Um, it was literally like working with clay. Like it was the most impossible thing to freaking use. Like I'm gonna show you what this pot looks like after I attempted this look. Like, look at that. Look, do you know how difficult it was to freaking work with that? Oh my goodness. It was like rock solid. And like I was thinking maybe I need to heat it up, but like I shouldn't have to because the other colors are so easy to work with. Like they just glide on. This one just didn't at all. Maybe it's like the color that's making it thick and like difficult to use. I don't know, but wasn't too pleased about that um, but other than that like generally I think it looks like the picture uh, obviously I added the glitter in the inner corners because that yellow didn't necessarily match the pastel yellow that I have for the cream gel um, the cream gel obviously isn't as smooth as the picture is but overall, I think it looks generally the same if not it's in the family of the same so I'm not upset about it. I'm just upset about the freaking cream pot. Gel cream color. Just up. 
question. But it's fine. It's fine. But that's the look today. That's the makeup for today. Um, it's the video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. First video back. Of course, there's going to be some setbacks, some challenges. It's, it is what it is, man. Just, it's a learning curve. Right? Process of learning? I don't know. But, um... But that's it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, if you haven't already, don't be shy. Click subscribe. It's free. Do it. The little red button down below. Click it. Join the family. Make sure you turn that bell so you get notified each and every single time I make a new post. Give this video a big thumbs up if you guys enjoyed it. In the comments down below, let me know what other colors you want me to play with in this. Um, this is going to be making a lot of uh, an appearance in my next couple videos, I feel like. I'll leave all of my social media links down below, as well as this year, guys. This year, we're going to start streaming on Twitch. It's happening. We already have everything for it, so get ready for that. Make sure you guys are following on Twitch if you guys aren't already, as well as follow me on TikTok. I post on there quite often. And, guys, and, okay, Blowing Your 4.0 podcast is coming back. February 5th for season two. Uh, and I'm really excited. Jackson and I are filming today, the first episode back, and I'm super excited. And I uh, can't wait to see what this podcast has in store for us for 2022. So yeah, if you guys just want to come along and listen to uh, two best friends talk with everyone about their life experiences and just like life in general then I strongly suggest you guys come and listen to us we are on Spotify Apple podcast um, we're here on YouTube as well as I believe Google something Jax told me and I completely forgot but it's on Google podcast Google something so uh, yeah wherever you guys find podcasts we're most likely there so give us a listen uh, and that's it. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!